Well, sadly, for those who are exposed to the elements, I'm afraid that the clouds have opened up and it is teeming down here. There are some fans who are going to get very, very wet. Having said which, there are almost no empty seats. It is a terrific turnout under the circumstances. There's nowhere else to go, in truth, if you want to see this much-anticipated game. So, come rain or come shine, we are here and really looking forward to it. This place, simply a monument to the game. So much prestige, so much pride, so much passion whenever football is played here. So, Jim Beglin, what is your interpretation of the way they appear to be lining up? Well, if flexibility doesn't have an influence on this system, we truly are looking at an approach that is quite negative. But at least there is good scope to turn a seemingly deep-lying defence into a more dangerous attacking outfit. This system will allow plenty of attacking numbers without necessarily compromising on that discipline. So it's down to business here. Johansson. Johansson. It has got through to him. Good clearance and very necessary. Johansson. Is there any support? He might not need it. And he's cut it out. Cuts it out. Norwich have opted to really stretch the game now. Yeah, that's pretty evident, but... What's their thinking? Um, I, it looks as if the opposition are happy to defend the width of the 18-yard box, trying to remove that compactness. Out towards the flank. That'll be a throw. Not a good throw at all, really. He's given away possession cheaply. Looks to dink one in. And he's there to clear it. Oh, that is asking for trouble. And here comes the corner. Only partially clear. Has a go! Decent enough try. Well, even for him, that may have been a touch ambitious. Dowell, over to the left. Dowell! He's come loose. Just brushed off the ball there. He could have been in, just needed a better final ball. Ah, quality deserted them when they really needed it. It'll be a throw in. Intercepts the throw. That's well read. And he's made sure that that won't get through. Dowell. Norwich have a free kick.
Johansson. Oh, good interception. Well, he acknowledges that he should have come up with something better there. The movement was good, but the pass lacked authority, uh, a cause of mild frustration. And the referee brings the first half to a close. So both sides have drawn blanks. They have toiled at times, but it's not been a bad game by any means. What have we learned from the first 45 minutes? Unspectacular, but solid, and that solidity could yet be the foundation for them to, to go on and win. So they head in, no further forward. The score here, still nil-nil. The action has already resumed here. So deadlock still as the second half begins. Questions were asked, but he's given the answers. Skip. Tries to get it forward quickly. Loose ball, who's going to get that? Dowell plays it out to the flank. I think that's a corner. Yes, it is. Well, there is some activity down on the touchline. It seems there's going to be a change. Gets wrestled off the ball, and he has been fouled there. Just a talking to, I think. Yes, it is. Too heavy, Cooper can pick that up. Adoma. Very few chances to talk of, Jim. Defence is, it seems, on top here. Yeah, I think it's a scoreline in keeping with what we've seen up to this point. Combined attempts at goal aren't high in numbers, and we could do with something to spark this contest into life. Hoists it forward. It's a promising ball. Shot at goal! Carroll. Floats one over. Keeper sends it forward. Dow gets it back. Has he picked him out? Concentration levels are very good, and so is the commitment. This game could yet yield a winner. Well positioned to make that interception. He hits one! Sides then taking this chance to turn to their benches. Final seconds, this has to be it. And he's shown him, tries a shot! And that's caused a worry or two.
We have got changes here from both sides, in fact. Fitz has got rid of that. It's often the timing of the jump that dictates what you can do with any header, and if you get it slightly wrong, then you'll struggle. But that was beautifully met, it really was. Well, it's an inspired substitution. Terrific move by the boss. That's how you make an impact as a sub. You know, when most are tiring, you can impose a freshness and energy to best effect. What an introduction. A 1-0 lead established. So that's it. It is all over. What a game. End to end, it flew by, and in the end, it all came down to just the odd goal. Thrilling, nail-biting, perhaps frustrating until the very end, but we do have a winner. Well, I just think that determination and persistence has paid off handsomely to, to squeeze the win out of a draw. Sometimes... It comes down to grit and desire and the stubbornness to keep plugging away. And uh, this has been great staying power. And thanks to Jim alongside me, and as the fans make their way home, so must we. Good evening to you.